So do you guys want a sneaky little method, a sneaky little trick in how you can deck out your early player within Hogwarts Legacy in full legendary gear? Well, that's what I bring for you today. Okay, so this trick, some will probably say it's an exploit. I don't really think it's an exploit. You're not really doing anything. Well, you're not really exploiting anything, if I'm honest. But hey, this will allow you guys to basically kit out your player in full legendary gear real early on but hey now i have your attention guys if you do enjoy the video leaving a like really helps me out and if you like what you see and want to see more hogwarts legacy videos on a daily basis make sure you subscribe and turn those bell notifications on okay so what you are looking at right here guys is a chest and this is a chest which guarantees you a legendary armor piece now what's well this is the chest basically you use this sneaky little trick with now these chests are found all over the map uh, there's one in hogsmeade which i'll show you in a quick second there's one uh, within hogwarts castle where you have to do a little bridge challenge which i'll show you in a quick second too and there's also this one here i found which is what i'm going to demonstrate to you guys with today so this is a maze found within hogsmeade valley as you can see right here on the map and well if you enter this hedge the right way you'll see a maze will spawn now if you stick to the right of this maze guys just follow it around you'll eventually come to this chest Now, once you've actually got to this chest guys don't actually open it right here what you want to do is make a manual save so once you have that save you are good open the chest now you will get a guaranteed legendary for a certain slot for your player but here's where that trick happens if this is a legendary for a slot you've already got a legendary in and you want it in another slot well this is where this trick really works simply guys just load back up that manual save you just created upon doing this guys you'll be able to run this maze again and open this chest once again it really is that simple convince and repeat this method until you get a legendary in a specific slot that you need so that's very cool indeed now there is another one of these chests within hogsmeade village which you're seeing on screen now this one I've already opened, but I can show you guys the location of it. But yes, guys, you can use this chest too. And then we have another one within the Hogwarts castle. This is located underneath a bridge where you have to actually gain access to. And there's a, a, a simple little puzzle here you have to do. And what I'll do guys is I'll showcase to you guys a clip from my video I posted earlier, which will show you exactly how you open up this secret little passage to grab this chest. So any food flame around this area, I actually had to run here to unlock this, but hey, I went to this food flame right here, literally come out the door and run across to this one which i'm at right now but yeah get to this area guys i mean there's a million and one different ways to get here and you are good to do this actually this is probably the better one to run to actually the labu annex and then just run down the staircase and come here but this is where you need to get to so where i'm at right now is that through flame so i'm just going to run down these stairs not down them come down here and you want to go out of these doors when they load there we go you can see the bridge right there so there's actually a puzzle here and it's well it's relatively simple to um to figure out now what you will need is guys is this potion right here incendio now incendio is rewarded for you after you complete the quest line one of the main quest lines uh professor hecat's assignment one this is i think it's about the ninth one after the prologue so it's pretty early on guys you've probably got this already but once you've got this guys have it equipped and it's quite simple so you can see these four uh flames here 
you can interact with these. And you need to light them first. So you need to come up to them. There's wire ones on each side of the bridge. So one there, one there, one there, and one there. So you need to literally just light these up. Just like so. Do the same in this one. Uh, that one's already lit up. Sometimes some of these are already lit up. Sometimes they ain't. I don't know what that is all about. Let me just double check. There we go. And then guys, well, it's quite simple. Starting looking at, because this is the symbol here. So looking from this direction, you need to interact with each one of these. And you need to see, if you come up close to them, you can see there's little like numbers on them. And you need to interact with this one until it goes one past the three. You can see the three there. Click it one more time. So it's got four. Simple. This one here, guys, it needs to be on two. There we go. Because, because I said that about that one there, if you look closely, it's actually, you have to zoom right and it still looks like three, but it's actually a four. But yeah. And there we go. So this one up here, guys, this one has to be a three. So, right, bam. And wait there, I'll show you the, the fourth one needs to be a number one. Because that will open, but this one here needs to be one. Just like so. If it ain't on one, change that to a one. And then, guys, you see that secret passageway opens up simple can we open it don't worry uh, so yes this one needs to be on four that one needs to be on two back right there needs to be on three back left needs to be on one and then guys simply open this up and you can travel down just like so uh, let me just pull out my i haven't actually got it equipped oh never mind don't matter it doesn't matter you can see what we're doing here i lighten up the screen for you guys but yeah if you walk along here guys there are a few chests for you to collect here a big one on the end too so yes you won't want to miss this space but yes guys this is how you uh solve this um this bridge puzzle come down here and get that oh an identified head item nice i don't think i missed anything else just in case oh yes i did right there right there there we go. Oh, nice. And there we have it, guys. That is how you solve the secret bridge. But yes, guys, have fun with this. If you guys know of any more of these legendary chests, be sure to let us know down below within that comment section. We can hit me up on my Discord. Uh, link down below too. But hey, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If it helps you out, leaving a like really helps me out. And hopefully, guys, I will see you on that next one.